Hey what's going on guys, Tersi Bertie here and welcome back to another Minecraft modding tutorial for version 1.16. In this tutorial I'm going to be covering how we can go ahead and create a creative tab or item group. So in our main class we just want to go ahead and create a public static class and I'm going to call this tutorial group and this will just extend item group and you just want to import that of course we then just want to add the constructor so that will be the one with just a string we don't need the one with an int and then we add the unimplemented methods so creative tabs are extremely simple as you can see so in here you could for example just put the name of the tab right like that so you could just say tutorial tab um, and then for create icon um, it's just the item stack that you want the icon to use so for that you can just say item in it dots and then your item so um, example item for example uh, dot get and then that will just be an item so we need to call got Blah, 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 dot get default instance and that will get us the default instance of that item stack if you want to use a vanilla item you can go ahead and use items dot and then you've got like acacia boat dot get default instance um, so you can do that I'm going to stick with item in it uh, item in it dot example item dot get dot get default instance then um, I'm actually going to remove this here and I'm going to once again super off of label and there's a few other methods we can use in here so we can use um, there's background things so if you want a particular background um, you can get the tabs image so the actual image for the tab you can get like tab pages you can change all these different things um, and there's also um, the fill method and in here you can just go ahead and actually um, fill your item group to have it in a specific order so by default it just goes by registry order um, but if you change this fill method and presuming you're not calling the super because if you call the super that will add all the items that are already in the tab if we just use fill and use for example items.add um, items.acacia boat for example then that will add acacia boat if we then call the super for example that will add the acacia boat and then all of the items just for example um, so yeah I, d I don't want that method but you can have that method if you want that method then we just need to go up to the top with all our constants and create a public static final this will be an item group and I'm just going to call this tutorial underscore group and that will just be equal to a new tutorial group and because we uh, are supering off of this label that we take in we need to pass in the label here so that will just be a tutorial or I like to call it tutorial tab so that it's different from my mod ID um, I mean you could just pass your mod ID in here I suppose but yeah I mean it's up to you it just needs to follow the uh, normal naming convention of like registry things and then to use this group so if we want to set an item to be in this group instead of doing item group dot building blocks we can go ahead and say um, tutorial tutorial mod dot tutorial group and yeah simple as that um, I'm actually going to do this for all of them so they're all in one place I think that's just um, a lot easier to see everything that we have 
and yeah that's pretty much it so I'm going to go ahead and run the game actually no I'm not I'm not going so what we actually need to go ahead and do is do our lang so it doesn't show up as a weird name so let's just come in here and we can say that item group so that is a capital G item group dot and then whatever we called it so we called it tutorial tab and I can just say that is the um, I can say tutorial items and now if we go ahead and run the game we should see this working okay so guys as you can see I am now in the game um, and if I go into here we can go ahead and um, load up my creative tab and see these items right here so our block our special item with the tooltip and all that um, our example block and our example item so yeah I'm going to be obviously using this for all of the rest of my tutorials um, yeah I mean that's pretty much it that's, that's all there is to creative tabs so I hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial if you did please do be sure to smash your face into that like button and you know what you might as well subscribe as well um, and hit that notification bell if you don't want to miss when I next upload obviously do remember my discord server will be linked in the description so if you do need help with any problems um, there will be people there to help you so yeah I will see you guys in the next video goodbye